how to place an image inside a shape in Affinity Photo. Go to the diamond tool or any of the other tools, create a shape. Once you've got that, you can then go along here, along the control bar, all the way to the end, and you may find it here, these arrows, but you might find it here. So third one, click and insert inside. That's the key thing. Make certain you use the insert inside. Then go to file and then down to place and then select an image. And this could be anything, a PNG. I'm just gonna go with a JPEG file and this is Adobe stock image. Click open and now you'll see this little cursor. Just click and now that is applied inside that shape. Now you can select it, so you've got it here, selected, and you can now move it around using the move tool. So just reposition it, that's using the move tool, put it anywhere you want. You can also go to the diamond itself, select that, and then reposition that. You can hold down the alter option key, and you can then duplicate that shape, and also the image inside, and you could repeat that as well. You can also, if you want, go to the shape, then click here, make certain that's selected, and you can resize this. So let's just resize it. Once you've resized it, you can also duplicate this design. Hold down the alter option key, that's on the keyboard, and drag, and that will duplicate that image inside the diamond. And you can repeat that multiple times to create all kinds of different imagery. If you want to import another image, make certain you go along the control bar again, make certain this insert inside is turned on, make certain the diamond is selected, and then go to File and down to Place. Again, select any image and click Open. And again, click and it's applied inside that. If you've already got an image open and you've got your shape, all you need to do is go to the Layers panel. With that selected, the Adobe Stock image, simply just drag it down and make certain the whole of that layer is selected. You see it's all blue all along and release. Then drag it into the position there, and you can resize it, move it around, as long as it's still selected. You can then go to the donut, and you can then move that around and resize that, as well as rotate it. Hope you found this tutorial of interest. Any questions, please let me know in the comments below. A like or dislike, always appreciated. Also, please subscribe. Thank you much.